Club of Colombo and Candy and also signed new agreements with the Rotary Club of Sofia Vitosha and the Rotary Club of Varna at Bulgaria. Our club presented the Lifetime Achievement Award on the 14th of October 2014 to Dr. Shivadanu Pillai, a pioneer of defense technology in India and the CEO of Brahmos Aerospace at a function attended by several diplomats and socialites. We also presented the Young Achiever Award on the 12th of May 2015 to Arman Ibrahim, a true blue Chennai boy and a name to reckon with in the Indian and global motorsports industry. Both the awards were excellent choices by the awards committee led by President Venkat Ramani. The 52 issues of our weekly bulletin Lighthouse were so beautifully brought out by Assistant Secretary Rotarian Prabha this year and it consistently won the praise of the district governor and district officials apart from the members of our club. This effort of Prabhas got recognized by having got, won the Outstanding Bulletin Award from the Rotary Club of Metro and the Best Newsletter Award from the District 3230. Thank you, Prabha, for everything. This year, we distributed education scholarship for over rupees 11 lakhs to 128 school students, five college students, and the Boys Town College students from Selayur and Gumudi Pundi. The scholarships were distributed on the 29th of November 2014 at a function well organized by our Rotarian Anuradha Ganesan and presided by our District Governor, Rotarian ISAK Nazar. Our members have been generous this year in their contribution to the Rotary Foundation. We had three major donors this year and 12 Rotarians contributing over $1,000 each. The polio immunization drive, ably organized by Rotarian Dr. Ramasubramaniam and past president Rotarian Indra, was attended by over 25 Rotarians. It is important to highlight that the Rotary Club of Madras is the pioneer on the Polio Plus program. Our club had launched two pathbreaking projects during this Rotary year, the Rotary Flame Project and the Sanitation Project. Our president had the vision of stopping open defecation much before Prime Minister launched the Swachh Bharat campaign. His vision was to bring about a behavioral change and stop open defecation, which will lead to better health. Our director, Suresh, ably supported by Rotarians Nagarajan and Raja, very effectively translated the vision of our president and made Amarambedu the first open defecation village, free village. We also appointed Vishwanathan Anand as our, and actor Jeeva as the brand ambassador of our club on this Swachh Bharat campaign. To herald a polio-free India and create awareness on a polio-free world, our president Srikant launched the ambitious Rotary Flame project this year. This project saw the flame travel to many countries and win praise from the Rotary International President, the officials of the RI, lakhs of Rotarians and public wherever it traveled. During its journey, the Rotary Flame also raised substantial funds for the Rotary Foundation. It was a very proud moment for every RCMR when the Rotary Flame was taken on stage by our President Srikant and past President Rotarian Gopinath at the recent Rotary International Convention held in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Even as we got accolades for the two new projects, our committed Rotarians led by enthusiastic chairman of the various service projects continued to scale up the quality and quantity of support extended to our ongoing projects in Rotary Nagar, Sembakam, Selayur, and Gumdi Pundi. This year, we not only gave structural strengthening and a new coat of paint to our Rotary Nagar campus, but also introduced several new initiatives like health checkup for the women in Rotary Nagar, computer training, program and brought in a new batch of teachers. In fact, we also gave uh, the children new writing desks from China thanks to the initiative of our past president, Guna. 
The quality of uh, Roti Club's work has so impressed our principal sponsor, Kone, that they have significantly scaled up their financial support and assured to fund more facilities at our Rotary Nagar. Well done, Rotary Nagar team, led by Vice President Guna and Krishnan. Our ever-smiling Rotarian Jayashree and her team have strived to constantly improve the quality of Rotary Club's involvement in the Sembakam project. The broadening smiles of the beneficiaries confirm the excellent work being done by the Sembakam committee. Thank you, Jayashree. Our boys town at Gumudi Pundi and Seliyur have witnessed several initiatives this year. Director Nimish, Dr. Prabhakar, Balraman Kannan, Rotarian Balraman Kannan and the boys town committee under the constant encouragement and guidance of our RCM Doyens, past district governor Benjamin Cherian and past president Christopher have raised the bar this year at both the boys town centers. Several new initiatives like spoken English course from the Karate Path program vocal singing sessions under the care of our gifted Rotarian Anil Srinivasan and karaoke music sessions have all been undertaken this year. Rot Rotarian past president Dr. Ramchandran scaled new heights by conducting 11 major health camps during this year through which general, dental, eye and ENT care was provided to over 9,000 beneficiaries. Joining hands with Dr. Ramchandran through their hospital and medical teams were our past president Indra, Dr. Arunmuri Varvan, Rotarian Shano Ravi and Vijaya Bharti. Thank you, Doctor and our Rotarians. A very capable director for youth services, Rotarian Sati Ram Ram, ably supported by Rad Rotarian Rajshekar Gorantla and his team, had successfully completed the installation of RCM's nine Rotaract and 23 Interact clubs, including one new Interact club at the American International School in Chennai this year. The Raila camp was successfully held this year on the 30th and 31st of January 2015 at the Brahma Kumari Retreat Center in Kanchipuram. 165 students participated and thoroughly enjoyed the two-day event. Our Rotarians also supported the medical treatment of Banu, an interactor from the Children's Garden School. To fund the ongoing and new projects, our club had organized several fundraising events this year. The Dandia Night, so wonderfully put together by our past president Rotarian Satyan and Rotarian Ayan Parul, the art auction by our Rotarian Sanjay Tulsiyan, the golf tournament, a very committed effort from our president nominee, Dr. Arul Mori Verman, the Moulin Rouge play organized by Rotarian Anand Vergis and Rotarian Vidya. The cricket tournament organized by our uh, Rotarian P. N. Mohan. Uh, sincere thanks to all the Rotarians who toiled hard to make these fundraisers a big success. <laughs> our treasurers Rotarian Aditya Garwal, Sukumar and Arjun Anand, ably supported by Director Nimish, had ensured that the finances of our club were always in good health and all payments to Rotary International as well as district and community service projects were made on time. Our sergeant at arms, past presidents Aluwalia, Dr. Ramchandran, KK Raman, and Rajendra Sabanayagam helped start all our weekly meetings on time. Our Rotarians not only serve the society well, but also enjoy their time together. The fellowship committee, under the dynamic leadership of my good friend Rotarian Kapil, had put together a wonderful spring, string of fellowship events this year. Unique theme events like the Oktoberfest at Hyatt, the pub crawl held on the same evening at three venues of the Taj Group, the Bolivian night at the Park Sheraton, and the recent Hawaiian theme party at the Hyatt Regency caught the imagination and spirits of all our Rotarians. We also had this year the regular fellowship on the Pongal Day and the Christmas Day. I thank all the hosts of these fellowships. Thank you, Kapil. Apart from these full club fellowships, our Rotarians have also been enjoying the company of each other at many fire sites so thoughtfully planned by Rotarians Palniyappan and Geeta Nagu. My thanks to the hosts of these fire sites. District Governor Rotarian ISAK Nasser honored us with a three day visit this year. On the first day, he visited Boys Town in Gumudi Pundi and also participated in the Walk of Fame held along with the Thiruvallur District Collector. 
On the second day in the morning session, he visited our boys town at Selayur and uh, the women's empower center at Sembakam and later the evening visited Rotary Nagar and also ended the day with participating at our club assembly. On the third day, he participated in the evening at the DG's official visit meeting and praised President Srikanth and our club for its stupendous work. <coughs> President Srikanth and First Lady Subha hosted a wonderful Thanksgiving party on the 24th of June this year. On the morning of this event, we had past Rotary International President Rotarian Kalyan Banerjee visit our boys' town in Gumdi Pundi and also witness the wonderful work done by our sanitation committee at the Amarambed village. He also visited the public health center under construction at our boys' town in Gumbadi Pundi. The evening event saw participation of our past Rotary International President Kalyan Banerjee, RA Director P.T. Prabhakar, and the district governor, all of whom lavished praise once again on President Srikanth for his Rotary Flame and Sanitation projects. I'll be failing in my duty if I do not recognize the constant guidance I received from the doyens of RCM, past district governors, Benjamin Cherian, J.B. Kamdar, Krishna Swami, Ramakrishnan sir, and the constant encouragement from all the past presidents and senior members, the committed support of my fellow directors on the RCM board, and most importantly, the confidence and encouragement of my president, Srikanth. I thank the RCM secretariat staff and team Hotel Konimera for their support throughout the year. I thank my wife, Geeta, for permitting me to spend so much work and take time away from the family this year to do justice to the Rotary work. I end my address by apologizing for any lapses I may have committed this year and share my overwhelming confidence that the future of the Rotary Club of Madras looks very promising and bright. I thank you all for your patience and the opportunity for this presentation. Thank you. Thank you. Secretary Ravi Shankar for that wonderful report. Fellow Rotarians, we now come to one of the highlights of today's program, which is the presentation of the club awards. The suspense is killing and worthy of an Oscar awards function as absolutely no one knows who these winners are. We have seven annual rolling trophies to be awarded and we request President Srikanth to come forward and present the club awards for the year 2014-15. Thank you, Jakes. One of the most unfair things is to <coughs> task the president with choosing the awardees. That's a tough call. Anyway, I have tried my best and I know my choices will not be perfect. I know there'll be so many others who are deserving of these awards, but then we have to choose a few, so bear with us. Best Chairman of the Year. Any guesses? There's two of them. Suresh is not a chairman, he's a director. There's, there's, there's two of them. Chairman number one, Chairman of the Sanitation Committee, Rotarian M.S. Nagarajan. Hey, you, sir. Thank you for your sunshine of 10,000 rupees. <laughs> Ch chairman number two, Chairman of the Rotary End Polio Flame Committee, Past President N.K. Gopinath. Ladies and gentlemen, this trophy was instituted by M. Prabhat Kumar. The best avenue of service, again, a tie. You see, both these projects made it all the way through to the San Paolo Convention of Rotary International. So what could I do except award, again, the best avenue of service uh, prize 
to two directors jointly. Firstly, Director P. Suresh, Director of Community Services. And our ever smiling Dr. Rajan, Director of International Services. Instituted by Rotarian Pratap Hansraj. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Jakes. And I think we should also say who instituted the best chairman award. I don't have the list. I had mentioned that it was uh, instituted by M. Prabhat Kumar. Thank you. Thank you. So thank you so much for helping me out. And I should have had that list with me. Firstly, it is not my doing making these trophies so big and heavy. Okay. Outstanding contribution by a green Rotarian. We have so many well-qualified Rotarians for this. First and foremost, Rotarian Rajesh Somasundaram. He's, he's not here, he's in Burma, but he did say that his wife is going to be here, is he? No. Mithuna? No. Okay. Rotarian Krishnamurti Vijayan, and Rotarian Shan Katari. Unfortunately, all three of them are not here. We will give the award to them at a later date. The, this the, the award card. was instituted by, is the GM J. Pratap Memorial Award. Thank you. The next one is an award to promote comradeship amongst Rotarians. This goes, firstly, to past president, Guna. He's always the life of every party, taking his pictures. And secondly, our smart fellowship committee chairman, Kapil. Ladies and gentlemen, this award was in, is the R.P. Sarathi Memorial Award. Next comes the Best Rotarian Award. I decided to give this to, to two rather unreliable people. Unreliable because you cannot say that they will always support you. They will support you when, you, when they think you're right, and they won't support you when they think you're wrong. And I think that is the hallmark of a true Rotarian. First and foremost, Rotarian Aditya Agarwal. who will be joined by Rotarian Vidya Amarnath. Ladies and gentlemen, this rolling trophy is instituted by A.V. Mayor Panchetia. Best Rotarian couple. In recent years, we have had an influx of a lot of young Rotarians, and uh, we decided to induct a Rotarian who wasn't uh, to award an award uh, a Rotarian who wasn't inducted that long ago, 
but young at heart, and this couple is.